recording. This is our memorabilia mixer. These are our teams. If it's an NFL jersey or helmet, it's a no-brainer. It goes to that NFL team. If it's a college jersey or helmet, active player will go to the team they're on at the end of last season. We don't start the new teams until the regular season officially starts. The new rookies will go to the team that they are drafted on and in camp with right now. If it's a retired player and it's a college jersey, it'll go to the team they played the most seasons with. If they played for two teams the same number of seasons, the tiebreakers total games played. If we get any multi-signed things that aren't the same team, like a Hall of Fame helmet with multiple signatures on it, you got any pictures on the more. If we get any movie memorabilia, which I don't think TriStar does, they'll be random to everybody in the break. That's like Coach Klein, uh, Henry Winkler signing a Mud Dogs jersey, so on and so forth. Pretty self-explanatory. First, TriStar Seal. Couldn't get that one open, could I? Dun 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 For the E-Girls, Ron Jaworski, quarterback extraordinaire. The E-Girls on the board. X R where are the stickers at? What in the world? I can't find where the stickers are. There they are. XRC. And the E-Girls. Helmet number two. That Canadian dude is just going crazy on the triathlon. He's going to smoke everybody. Seal. This must be the 1500. I think that's the last one. I think that's the last event is a 1500. For the Rams, Jack Youngblood. Hall of Fame 2001 for the Rams. Kenny Hasty. First jersey. Tri Star Seal. Dun 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 dun. Looks like Troy Smith from Ohio State. I don't know why they put the Troy Smith in here. Um, he played briefly. I think he played for one team for two years and one team for one year, if I remember correctly. Let us check. Troy Smith. Football quarterback. Pro reference. Baltimore Ravens for three years. San Fran for one year. So he's a sneaky Raven. He's a sneaky raven. Well, he was drafted by the Ravens, but, I mean, there's, the rules are the rules are the rules. If it's a college jersey, it goes to the team he played the most seasons with if it's a retired player. But that would be Baltimore. Sneaky raven style. Without rules, there is chaos. Chaos, chaos, chaos. RFP Jr. Ron getting a big dog. Ohio State jersey. Billy P would like that jersey. 
Billy P would like that jersey. Last one. Good luck, everybody. Who could it be? Who could it be? Looks like a Tony Dorsett. Oh, wow. It's one of those uh, cool ones. Tony Dorsett. That's pretty cool. I think that's just a weird Cowboys jersey. Let me check something real quick. Yeah, it's a Dallas. Dallas Cowboys. University of Pittsburgh. Cowboys number one pick. He didn't play it almost. It's just a weird looking Cowboys uniform, I guess, because it's not Pitt, it's not the right color for Pitt. Um, and the only other team he played for one year with Denver, maybe Cowboys, baby. Artie, USMC. That's pretty cool because it has all the stats and and uh, and embroidered in it. That's I like those. I have my Frank Thomas is like that. Yeah, we got the Jaworski and the the Ron Jaworski wasn't a bad one. And we got that slamming Troy Smith jersey. Mr. Ron. Got slamming. <laughs> 